Yo, guys, Urban Bars brings you the best UK reactions to rap, hip hop, and urban music from all around the world. And guys, we're in the UK with our man Ren, and I can't wait to hear this track. It's called Power. I don't know anything more about it. And guys, let's just get into this. Get it? Uh. Power. <laughs> Love this power. So when was this done, guys? Was this done a few years ago? I quite like it. I like the high, sort of the percussiveness on this track. And what kind of track suit is he wearing there, guys? <laughs> I'm not sure I didn't catch it, but... I'm going to wheel this again and we're going to check this out guys. So this is our man Ren and this is Power. Get it? Uh. Power. Wow, so he's put some kind of thing on his voice there. Let me get all the high end. Oh, the guy's got a car hat hat. What's that? It's not a Sergio Tachin, is it? I'm not sure. I'm not sure what tracksuit that is, guys. It reminds me of back in the days in the 1980s, guys. But yeah, I just love our man's voice. So he's really just experimenting with that vocal effect. These kids don't play my shit. I never had a top 10. Maybe it's because I sing about violence and depression. Oh. These guys don't play my, I've never had a top 10. Maybe it's because I talk about violence and depression. Oh my goodness. I like that, that was a good start. I never had a top 10. Maybe it's cause I sing about violence and depression. They say don't blame these kids, just focus on yourself, friend. Well, if they don't like what I'm doing now, then fuck them. Don't trip high up the ante, learning licks like John Prashanti. Smoking spliffs and popping candy, idolizing Sid and Nancy. Woo, rock and roll in my soul, bumping that. That's so funny. So he said he's like doing spliffs and idolizing people like Sid and Nancy. And I said in the previous reaction I did to this, and I had to write it down, it was called Losing It, the Fisher Retake. I said in one of the scenes, he reminded me of Sid Vicious from the Sex Pistols. I wasn't sure if it's Sid Vicious or Malcolm McLaren or whoever at the time I was saying, but then he just mentioned, he just name checked Sid and Nancy here. Weird. Guys, and I've literally just done that last one just five minutes ago. I just changed my top of my hat, really, because I was a little bit hot. I had all the windows shut and it got a bit warm in the room, guys. But I literally did that five minutes ago. Really? God, I'm going to wheel this back again. Here we go. <clears throat> Fuck them. Don't trip high up the ante. Learning licks like John Pashanti. Smoking spliffs and popping candy. Idolizing Sid and Nancy. Woo! Rock and roll in my soul. Bumping, knocking cold. On the dole. Fish and oh. chips and games consoles. Council house and violent flow. But life went sweet at home. Mum and dad took a trip and they split shalom. What will be, will be. But me, I hate to see my mama. So life wasn't sweet at home. Mum and dad took a trip and they split shalom. So did they go to somewhere in Israel and did his parents split up for good? I don't know, guys. I don't know Ren's story. So guys, if you know, put it down in the comment section. I'm just going to wheel that back a bit, guys. So it's funny because with Ren, at one point, you're going to have so much upbeat stuff. And then suddenly it's going to hit you with some real, real hardcore downbeat stuff, which is really it's. You know, you have to stop and think and think, oh my goodness. King Cole, on the dole, fish and chips and games consoles, council house and violent flow. But life went sweet at home. Mum and dad took a trip and they split shalom. What will be, will be, but me, I hate to see my mum alone. Late night crying, get so high to try to silence sounds of fighting. Through the walls, I heard love dying, so I focused on my... And at that bit, you heard him doubled. I heard him doubled in my right ear, sort of lower in the mix, our man Ren. So he just doubled up that, almost like re-emphasized what he was talking about. So the sadness, like with his mum crying, all that sort of fighting and everything, blah, blah, blah. See my mum alone, late night crying, get so high to try to silence sounds of fighting. Through the walls I heard love dying, so I focused on my... That's 
was what it was. I focused on my. What is the instruments? And what are the sounds that are making that really high endy kind of sound? It's cool. I like it. What it was. Oh, is that Lacoste? Hold on, sorry, I just saw the sign of the cross. That's what it was. I focused on my. Now let's go back. Let's go back. These kids don't play my shit. I never had a gold plaque. My style is old school, but I swear this ain't a throwback. My style is old school, but I swear this isn't a throwback. And as he said, let's go back, you could hear them reversing the track. So it's almost like you're reversing the turntable. You could just hear the brr, 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 brr. You can just hear the beat flipping backwards. Wow, let's go all school. The gold track. My style is old school, but I swear this ain't a throwback. I put my visions into rhythms on a dope track. To mm. understand the place I'm coming from, let's go back. When I was 16, I was a sick teen. I was a victim of my head. I was just 16, up oh. in the kitchen, racking up lines till my nose bled. So this goes back to when he was 16, he was a victim of stuff in his head. So is this talking about the Lyme disease? I don't know. Of my head. I was just 16, up in the kitchen, racking up lines till my nose bled. Oh, and he's taking long. <laughs> really? I'm coming from, let's go back. When I was 16, I was a sick teen. I was... So when I was 16, I was a sick teen. The victim of my head. And I was a victim team of my head so when i was 16 <clears throat> he said when i was 16 i was a victim sorry <laughs> i got that wrong so when i was 16 i was a sick team i was a victim of my head i think that's what he said but he just got the right enunciations all the way through on those on those bars the dope track to understand the place i'm coming from let's go back. when i was 16 i was a sick teen i was a victim of my head i was just 16 up in the kitchen racking up lines till my nose bled 16 in an affliction in an addiction with my dread i was just 16 i was quite sick then i was a prick then i was a pleb but fuck it we're all misguided individuals life can suck it my cop ain't half full man i'm feeling off the whole Bucket. I'll drink my tears so I can drown my sorrow. Sing like I might die tomorrow. Live for the butter, 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 butter. No for no, I go for broke on every single song I roll. And every single song I write brings freedom to my weary mind. A healing that you'll only find inside an intricate design of. Sorry, guys, I just started to think. So he's driving a left hand drive car here. Really? Okay. <coughs> Sorry, guys. <laughs> Guys, I think of the weirdest nonsense when I watch these and listen to these things. No for no, I go for broke on every single song I roll. And every single song I write brings freedom to my weary mind. A healing that you'll only find inside an intricate design. So he's saying that all the songs, you know, they start to heal him. It's cathartic. So all the stuff that Ren's been through, the writing and getting it out of his head onto paper, then onto wax, vinyl acetate onto digital format lossless sound or whatever is all a part of the process of healing wow every single song i write brings freedom to my weary mind a healing that you'll only find inside an intricate design of kicks and snares and fat bass lines i flip the script until i find my kicks and snares and fat bass lines whoa sound of the drum and the bass and i remember that that was first said by our man Tim Westwood many, many years ago, even before drum and bass became a certain form of music. I'm not saying my man's doing drum and bass here, but this is the bedrock of all this kind of music. It's the sound of the drum and the bass. But there you go, guys. Hmm. Only find inside an intricate design of kicks and snares and fat bass lines. I flip the script until I find my...
oh man i love that track that was another real upbeat kind of track there but there was a lot of sadness as well so he's talking about his mom's dad you know they split shalom etc but overall it was a track that i can really just jam to and ren has the ability to write music which can move you and that is a real tough ability as well and i love the video so he's just sitting in a car <laughs> him and i don't know who the other guy was you know but if you know who the other guy is let me know in the comment section guys here please because um, i'm sorry i don't know who he is but that was power and that was ren i love that track so obviously that must have been done a few years ago but when was saying as well you know even then he was getting traction from people and people saying to him you know oh you, you can't do this music blah 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 it's too full of violence and it's too full of depression blah 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 but you know music is as music is it's going to come out whichever way you put it in but I really like that. So that was power. That was Ren. I absolutely loved that, guys. Guys, let me know in the comment section what you think about that track. That was just so. I love that. And was he saying spirit or something? I'm not sure. I wasn't sure what he was saying there on the hook. So it was like wow, 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 wow. I can't sing, but there you go, guys. But I hope you enjoyed that. That was our man Ren. That was power. That was great. I absolutely loved that track. Guys, if you've already subscribed to my channel here at Urban Bars, thank you so much. If you haven't subscribed, guys, please subscribe to the channel and help me get up the old. Guys, can you like, share, hit the notification bell to let you know when I'm dropping more reactions? And guys more than all of that guys look after yourselves look after each other go outside have a good time actually guys have a great time but even more importantly than all of that guys and that is really important make certain you come back to the next urban bars reaction guys